Delhi's Andhra Bhavan was abuzz with political bigwigs from various states voicing their discontent at the 11th Finance Commission's proposed devolution of central revenues to individual states. Lining behind Andhra Pradesh Chief Minister Chandra Babu Naidu, Chief Ministers from five states and representatives from five others demanded the formation of an interstate council to look into the adverse effects of the Commission's recommendations. Naidu is basically saying that one, keep the share of various states like mine, at least at what they were in the 10th Finance Commission. Instead of giving 29.5% of the total kitty to states, increase that to about 32-33%. So you're basically saying give more to the states. Backing the Finance Commission's report, Prime Minister Atal Bihari Vajpayee directed these states to address their grievances to the supplementary report to the 11th Finance Commission, expected to be out by August 10. We have tried to see that the states are given a fair deal by working out their non-planned revenue deficits on a comparable basis using some norms, norms of both revenue and expenditure. Well, there are some limitations in that, but we have tried to be fair to all states by applying uniform standards. But as you can see, the gainers are there, losers are there. Uh, one lakh. Over the years, finance commissions have found themselves straddled with the unenviable task of bailing out profligate states, often at the expense of disciplined ones. How to mm, meet the disadvantage of the poorer states who are, whose revenue base is deficient because the income levels are low? And at the same time, uh, without punishing the, uh, the states which are doing better, it's a very difficult job. They are actually expecting states to contribute a lot more by way of raising user charges on electricity, on irrigation, overall tax revenues, you know, on, on state-sponsored state education and things like that. So in fact, to, according to me, that is a big grouse of people because a large part of the increased revenue of the states like Andhra in the next five years has to come from, you know, from raising rates on electricity and issues like that, which are obviously going to be very, very unpopular politically. With the so-called affected states like Andhra Pradesh, Haryana, Kerala and Maharashtra getting substantial hikes, analysts observe the furore over the 11th Finance Commission report has been motivated by concerns that are more political than economic. With the states now exercising a much greater control at the centre, Chandra Babu Naidu is being seen as a man with larger political ambitions. People in the state, you know, say that, okay, I'm sorry, you know, this guy has raised rates, but he never wanted to do it. It's only because the centre that did it. Secondly, to some extent, I suppose it even cuts uh, BJP votes in Andhra because, you know, people feel key. the BJP, you know, did it to them. So maybe there's a political logic to it. With the supplementary report to the 11th Finance Commission expected to do little to alter the devolution scheme, opinion makers believe Naidu and party might not get to score any more populist points. What this controversy has foregrounded is the need to take another look at our federal structure of governance. Let the states you raise their own resources, the center will raise its own resources. So that both feel that they are independent and federalism is an arrangement among the states to sort of um, come together as a political entity. As, a, as one people. So that should be the concept really of federalism that one should think of. If you go to a model today where the states have to do, you know, are allowed to do everything on their own, I think we are, we are leading to a complete split of the country. Today the way things are certain, just a handful of states which are mature enough to be able to look after themselves. There. So I don't think we are anywhere near a situation where we can tell the states that you take, you know, 100% of the kitty and do what you want with it. Despite the divided opinion on this issue, what is clear is that states would do well to exercise financial discipline or else fight for a larger dole in the center's pool of shareable resources, at times with little success.